Hello, everybody. Andrew Majewski here with Dental L. So it's here finally, but I have made a course for dental hygienists who want to have their own in-home dental hygiene practice. So I do have a separate course for those who want a mobile RDH practice, meaning you would travel to nursing homes and um, offer care that way. But this one will be specific to an at-home dental hygiene practice. And it's a little bit of a different one too, because I'm not talking about you know, cutting into the walls, cutting into the floor to have your $60,000 dental office chair, or, or how to have TVs on the ceiling, or how to have your, you know, high-end dental hygiene practice. No, this is more for those who don't want to spend $2 million, okay? I have my own at-home practice, and a lot of the equipment that I have is portable. So, so I can just wheel it in, wheel it out, but I did buy a patient chair that was about $300 versus like 20,000. So I have found sales deals where it, it, it matters most. And every patient that comes in says, wow, this is so cozy because your patients, if they wanna see you in your home, they don't want it to look like a dental office. I mean, yes, it does look like a dental practice, but they don't walk in nervous. They don't walk in anxious because it's so over the top dental practice setting. This is a cozy home environment. So I will teach you guys how to do exactly that, how to save money, how to not spend a fortune. It's still expensive. You will likely have to take out a business loan of about I think I did about $30,000 to get everything that you do need, but I did learn a lot along the way. So I will be teaching you guys how to save money, how to have a cozy at home dental practice and how to market that. So just a little tip is my marketing practice is all about sharing that, hey guys, come to me, my at home dental hygiene practice. You do not have to sit there in a dental office. There are no wait times. You don't have to sit there anxious and nervous seeing other patients who are also anxious and nervous. It doesn't smell like a dental office. You don't have to hear all of the commotion of having a dental practice. I do not take x-rays. I'm not a dentist. I am a dental hygienist. So they don't have to feel like they're going to have 20 x-rays taken or the dentist is going to come in for two seconds and charge them. Oops scared me. That was my alarm. Sorry guys. I'm tutoring later and this is just to um, remind me that I'm tutoring in about 45 minutes. Sorry. <laughs> that scared me. Um, so I will teach you guys how to market, how to advertise because I bet where you live there is not an at-home dental hygiene practice anywhere. Even if there is, there's not many and they're probably not marketing how I'm going to teach you guys how to market. I am busy which is great. I see three patients a day and that's busy for me. You might be thinking three patients, that's it. That's all I want, okay? But I will teach you guys how to get busy. What dental software is the best one to get that's not very expensive and will save you guys so much time? How to bill to insurance if you want to, how to accept cash only patients if that's the way you wanna go, how to order dental supplies where they're not crazy, ex um, crazy expensive, what you want to order in bulk, what you don't have to necessarily, how to do teeth whitening in your own home office, how to order an emergency kit. I teach you guys everything. And I should say, I should have said this at the beginning, this is specific for Ontario. This will probably work everywhere, but check to see if you are able to open up your own dental hygiene practice, because in our profession, depending on where you live, things are different. So I live in on, um, Ontario, so this is specific to that because I know our rules and the guidelines. But even if you're just thinking about one day opening up your own practice, this is for you because then you can see exactly how it is. So let me know, you guys, if you have any questions, I will leave the link for you on the bottom. The course will be available in March, so depending on when you're, when you're 
listening to this, when you're when you're um, watching this, it might be already available. It is now February the 29th, so still a couple weeks. But it's a full-on amazing course. And if you are able to travel to me, there will be a hands-on um, component also where I literally show you guys around how I do everything, how I sterilize, how I, I walk through every patient from the beginning of the appointment to the end. So there will be a hands-on component as well if you're able to make it to me, okay? Let me know if you guys are excited and I'll see you guys very, very soon.